on everybody welcome to beautiful Deer Creek Reservoir here in Utah uh, it's what January 12th and while the rest of the state is probably wisely fishing uh, the hard water uh, we found some open water there's uh, still a couple of reservoirs here in the Heber Valley that have somewhat open water we wanted to get the boat out get out and get after some browns and some rainbows so that's what we're gonna do here on this first trip of 2021 we are going to be throwing stuff we do just like we do at Jordanelle just some jerk baits ones that go down about anywhere from 5 to 10 feet perch bait fish colors uh, up at Sportsman's they said white tube jigs were working as well so should be a beautiful day uh, there's light wind and there's plenty of open water, so we're just going to be hitting the banks just like we do and uh, bringing these jerk baits and these streamers back in and see if we can't hook up. The other thing about today, it has been, gosh, it's probably been years, literally, probably at least a couple years since we've actually fished Deer Creek. So our expectations are super, super low. Like we kind of don't know what to expect. So I think any fish today would be a success. All right, here we go. This water temp's about 35 degrees, 34 and a half. This jerk bait will just be running right at about 10 feet. Air temperature should get up to about 40 today, so it should be a nice day. But with the water temp, probably every 10 or so casts, we're gonna have to be clearing our guides from the ice. So that'll be a challenge. There was another, okay, I'm marking a couple of these fish. Oh. Really? No, I was hitting the net. I think I'm graphing quite a bit of fish, just past 30 feet. How you been doing? Nothing. Yeah, we had all fall, I'll follow. What's that? One Last in the bank, we had one follow. Is that right? Yeah. <laughs> Dead out here. One fish. One fish. All we want. Oh, here's a bunch of fish. How deep? Like 45. You want to try and jig at them? Sure. Looks like there's something like down at 40 feet. Oh my gosh, ice. No. Nice. Catch and cook. Catch and cook. Here we go. Oh, it's a good rainbow too. Maybe that was a bite on that last. Nice net. Dude, that's a good fish. Yeah. Maybe we weren't fishing too deep.
Nice. All right, there's the one fish we were asking for. We're eating it. Good rainbow. Kind of a weird looking face, but kind of a weird, weird looking, looking tail, but it'll be a good one. Nice. Okay, so we weren't getting much with the jerk baits. And so me and Peter switched over to like a white little gulp and got a follow. And then so I put on this little swim bait and this is just a gulp minnow, a swim bait head and then a gulp minnow. <laughs> he was kind of in the middle of nowhere. We're like in a hundred feet of water just off the edge of this ice right here. And I, th oh, there's another fish about 40 feet down. But wonder if they're under there. Keep fishing the edge of this ice. Sweet, that was good. Frosty morning here. It's not really morning anymore. Frosty day up here at uh, Deer Creek, and we're gonna do a little bit of a catch and cook. What we got is we got a nice rainbow trout that Preston just caught, and then we've also got some uh, some ribeyes. So we're gonna do a little bit of a surf and turf with some veggies. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna cook that up for you guys, and uh, yeah, hope you enjoy. We're gonna just kind of show you how we do it. All right, now that my hands are absolutely frozen solid because I cleaned this fish, fish is all clean and I've now stuffed its gullet with uh, butter and some onion. And the final thing we're gonna do is we're gonna top it off with lemon pepper. We've got some butter already going with some garlic and oh my gosh, it smells good. So we're gonna hit the lemon pepper a little bit in the, just in the gut and then Hit the pan with just a little bit of lemon pepper as well. There we go. We are gonna just drop her on in there. Man, almost too big for the skillet. That's about as fresh as it gets. I mean, this was caught how long ago? Uh, 15, 15 minutes. minutes ago, yeah. Not as fresh as you get. Ready? Oh, we're going. Oh, no, okay. I got it. I got it. Oh yeah! Look at that. We don't have any forks. <laughs> that was good. That looks amazing. Add a little butter. Dude, it's like all caramelized yeah. and stuff on the top. Dude, that's legit. Try that. There's a bone in there. Well, look at that. Looks amazing. Dude. Oh my gosh, dude. Here we get. That doesn't look quite done there. This one? Yeah, get some of this one. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Wow.
Dude, the crusted and caramelized skin is here. Hand me the the camera. Camera is so good. Oh, dude. Dude, it's yeah. That's legit. Dude, that is good eats. So this is actually. I mean, this is the first time we've really cooked it this way. A lot of times we'll just put for, it in foil. For trout, we'll do tin foil usually. Foil and over the fire. All right, another. Um, all right, another amazing uh, nugget of our skin-on, pan-seared garlic, onion, and butter tr rainbow trout from Deer Creek. So good. Like, I'm not just YouTube faking this. This is delicious. Effing delicious. <laughs> All right. So uh, we just had our fish cooked up, sitting there in a plate, all ready to eat. And now we're moving on to the second course. We're just getting some uh, some veggies cooked up here. Gosh, it looks good. It smells so good too. You can smell the onion in there. And still smell the garlic, to be honest. That we're still in the pan. So yeah, we're just getting these veggies cooked up. I want to be healthy, you know. And then uh, I don't know if we'll do the steak. We'll do the steak. We'll do the steak? Okay. Just because it's steak. Alright. I mean, I can eat, so. <laughs> Gonna do steaks next. This is gonna be our last course. And so we're just getting the pan like real hot for the sear. Gonna do some garlic in there. And then obviously hit it with a healthy dose of butter. Get that just piping hot so we can get a really good sear. Preston, if you look over at the steaks, he's already got them. Just put a little bit up. of lemon pepper on there. Honestly, normally we would do Spade L Ranch. Spade L, please sponsor us. <laughs> but uh, didn't have any Spade L Ranch, so we're gonna be doing the, the lemon pepper instead. All right, so these are our ribeyes. It's gonna be our third course. Sear these up. Eat some more. Good sear. All right, we went kind of all out for our first ever catch and cook. Out here on Deer Creek, lucky enough to actually catch a rainbow. And we paired that with some steak and some veggies. So we have our fish here, our pan seared skin on fish, with some garlic, onion, and butter. And we have our veggies, some zucchini, yellow, squash, and some onion. And then we got our ribeye. So, about to get down on this and then maybe have an hour or so left of fishing so man this is it doesn't get much better than this out here on a boat we've just been chilling kind of all by ourselves it's been a really calm nice day it's been awesome it doesn't get better than this fish until the sun goes behind the mountain and then we'll freeze to death so
All right, well, nothing along this ice stretch. I think we're gonna try one more spot. <clears throat> There we go. Bring it back here. Yeah, careful, he's not done yet. I don't know how good of a hook set I have on him. He just kind of started pulling when it was sitting there. Nice. All right. Another bow. Nice bow, too. It's a lot nicer. Nice, Pete. Good net, good net, thanks. Yeah, another good one. Watch out, this one's gonna, this net can wiggle out. Okay. There we go. Uh, again, not terribly deep, but it was kind of just paused and sitting there. All right. Another bow. I don't want to handle them too much because it's bad for them and it's going to make my hand freezing cold. Another good one. Good first trip of the year for us and we did our first ever catch and cook right here on the boat. So there was only two fish that we ended up catching, uh, two rainbows, we caught them on gulp minnows, just a little uh, swim bait. But it was a really fun day, really beautiful day. We got the sunset behind us, good way to start the year. Remember, if you guys are new to our channel, this is the year we're selling out. So subscribe to our channel, try to get us to a thousand subs. We've been a channel for like almost 10 years now. So thanks for watching and look out. Look out. Thanks for watching. Done. <laughs>